What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, King's Ace, and I'm back. Before we get to it, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, make sure you always watch the full video. We're trying to hit, I'm trying to get to 1K by Christmas, so make sure you subscribe. But, <laughs> look, my whole thing about this stuff right here, bro, it's like, it's just funny. Like, look how many boys it is versus one girl, bro. And then, mind you, it's, it's at least three or four other people who made videos besides this six right here. <laughs> I didn't even know Terry made a video, bro. Like, this is it's wild that a bunch of boys, men, or whatever, are making truth videos about another man. To me, that's weird, bro. That's I, Mind you, when it comes to friendships, yes, they do get deep. Friendships really do get deep. But I don't see, like, boys, men making another truth video about another. That just look weird, bro. Like, if I could, like, all right, if I, me and my friend, if we have a falling out, we have a disagreement, we have an issue, I'm going to address it to you, if we can't resolve it, that's that. <laughs> We're, that's it. I'm not really going to make a whole video, and I see a lot of people, like, encourage, like, yeah, they did the right thing. Y'all just want to see somebody's name next to the word exposed. That's it. <laughs> I don't care who it is, what it's about, yes, as as his day one, as his friends, they had the right to feel what, whatever they feel. Hey, they even got the right to make their videos. Not saying that they're wrong, but it is a little weird, bro. Like, boys, men. <laughs> Making a truth video about another man. Boy, that's crazy, man. King said did post an apology statement on his IG addressing all the drama surrounding him. He said, as all of you can see, there's a lot of people trying to tarnish my name, my career, my character. I could try to give my side to the story and my experience with these people, but I'm choosing not to engage as I am one person against many, which is a losing battle. Although I'm a strong minded person with tough skin, I'm also human as well to protect my. He did make a video, but he deleted it because at least from, from what I seen from the comments, they still was not like, Nobody was going on his side. And it's because you got, it's you against so many people. And yes, from the stories, you was wrong, bro. I, I, I can admit that. You was wrong. You, you chose a, the, a chick that was from a, a two-man against all of your friends. Even though it's still, like, the way how they, how they was explaining it, was like, it still sounded weird, bro. Like, like you chose a girl over us, like. You're not the one he is smashing, bro. I hope not. You feel me? Hey, or if, hey, matter of fact, if that is what's going on, do you think? But it still was just a little weird. Y'all gotta admit that. Y'all gotta admit it's a little weird that men making another truth reader about another man. Y'all can't, y'all gotta admit that is a little weird, bro. Mental health, I'm choosing not to respond to the allegations made from everyone. The only people I would like to speak to are my supporters. I would like to apologize if you view me in a different light or if you're disappointed with me. I am truly sorry for my actions, my mistake, and my past. Although I do have a side to the story as well, you are entitled to have your own opinion. And it's my job from here on out to show you my true character and be a humble, good role model for you all. Because without you guys, I would never be where I am today. And I'm thankful and grateful for each one of you. Lastly, everyone's seen before, there wasn't a place or video I filmed without them. I tried my best to make sure they were always straight too. My parents treated them like family. My parents house was where they celebrated every holiday and I even tried to went as far as to move all of us in together so we could grow together. Never did I ever try to profit from my own personal gain. I hate that we fell out because of a situation months ago. Now they try to push this narrative on me of such a bad friend. King said. Why well, I feel like it's more to the letter like we missing a paragraph or something but uh. Yeah I don't care like like, again, from all the stories that I've seen, all right, it was one dude, they, they said they just spit in his face. That's super, super, super foul. Super disrespectful, especially that's be your friend. Like, that's wild, my boy. You for sure was wrong for that. The the SA uh, allegations, yes, as as a friend, I said it before when it came to, uh, when it came to, uh, to, to flow uh, thing. As a as a friend, if your friend is doing that, you got you gotta check them. Hey, bro, we don't get down like that. And if you really want to <laughs> press the issue, we can we can fight it. If that's what you want to do about it, you feel me? But other than like the, the him choosing a girl, like bro, 
at that point, at that moment, like he said, mind you, we are on the outside looking. There's always two sides to every story. He said he was going. He just, he was just out of his breakup with the girl Bree. So yes, he was hurt. So when a person hurt, you know what you going. It's either you finna be stuck in the house. You finna be a thought. Or you gonna find you gonna quickly find somebody to end up messing with just so you can get over your your past. He chose the third option, whether it, whether it was the right girl or not. Y'all should have been like, hey, this my bro. This what this what he need to this what he want to go through for uh, you know, for him to heal. I want to just make sure that this girl don't completely use him and drain him of everything. But I'm not gonna be on his head like, bro, you need to hair him, cut her off. Like, no, because you're going through something, and this is the person who's. Getting your mind off of that. I can only do so much as a friend. I can only do so much. I can talk to you. I can be the shoulder for you to lean on. I can be there for you to cry. But you still need that 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 bond with a you know with somebody you can go do something with. You really need that that moment. Well, therefore, as a friend, I'm gonna leave, I'm gonna let you have your your moment, your days, your weeks, your months, whatever. But I'm gonna just make sure this girl don't completely drain you out. You feel me? as a friend pause but i don't know like i feel like their whole situation they from his side their sides minus a lot of them it's all miscommunication instead of them sitting down talking let me talk to you without arguing it'd be arguments disagreement boys and men has too much pride sometimes we don't even know how to apologize so that, that'd be the problem that's what Kingston had to say. Y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all think when it comes to that. Now, let's talk about Leslie. Congratulations to her. She revealed yesterday that she is pregnant. My whole body was shaking. My hands were shaking uncontrollably. Like, I was in total shock. I couldn't believe it. I was like, there's no way that I'm pregnant. How? How is this possible? How, how am I pregnant? And I was like, Mom, I'm pregnant. I'm pregnant. Now, Carmen threw a little shade on TikTok, which I'm going to read that in a minute. But Corey claimed that he's not talking to anyone new. But there's a girl that Corey has been talking to on FaceTime. And I think this same girl from FaceTime is the same girl he went out to lunch with yesterday. No. Just let them see the, just let them see, cover your face up. No. Oh my fucking God. Bro. If y'all can see what he was saying, you gonna be talking shit. They will not be talking shit. We should go ahead. Yeah. You go, look, 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 they, they say they say it's them them dead air. They say your booty flat. That, so you talking to a flat booty bitch? Stop. Simp for the hoes, nigga. Make the hoes simp for you. You the try you. <laughs> First of all, I'm gonna need you by your goddamn business on the phone, right? You on my phone? Shut up. Ho ho. See what I'm saying? You see, you see, now y'all see, y'all see, I got a full hand check. Bro, doing all this to prove a point, dog. That's <laughs> a man. I can, I see through the bull. Cause if you was really just like didn't care and completely moved on, it wouldn't be no need for a lie. Especially when you know who you are, what you're going through. You know it's gonna go. You know the shade rooms, the tea rooms, or whatever is gonna pick up on this because what you're going through, what you and Carmen going through, and it's what Corey got a new girl. You know he know what he's doing. That's for sure. He knows what he's doing when it comes to the, when it comes to doing this stuff like this, bro. Like you doing this to prove a point, bro. And low key, as a man, look it looks low key sad. But then as a person who's been in love, who's a hey, went through a major man, boy, <laughs> them first love breaks up be crazy, boy. They be hard. Pause. So I, I understand it. I, I I feel it, cause boy, I was trying to do the most to get that girl attention, <laughs> but. Hey man, sometimes you just gotta move on the hill though. You feel me? You see how she playing me? She playing me with a lot, a lot of her playing like that. You feel what I'm saying? 
Yeah, whatever. Carmen posted her a TikTok. She said, me knowing there's nobody else like me. It girl. Because a lot of people in the comments of Corey's live was saying that the girl was the she in to Carmen. It was a whole lot of shade on that live yesterday. But anyway, now let's talk about CJ So Cool and Nike because in my previous video, I reported that CJ So Cool video with Kamari was removed by YouTube. Well, here's what Nike had to say. The link to the full interview is down below. Definitely go check that out. When you came on here, you were talking about Kamari uh, punishment or whatever would happen. And then he came back and he was like, oh no, it was fake. Or did a lot. And, 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 and let me just clear, clarify. The only reason why he said it was fake is because he got a strike for that. Okay. He got a strike Wait. because I guess the y'all they reported the it and then she was crying on there. And then the and guidelines it, or some shit they said. Right. The guidelines he went uh -huh. he went um he abused or whatever. It yeah. wasn't that it was fake. It's that's what he said. Bro, that looks like a B, we're gonna say that. We're gonna say it, it look like a B, bro. I ain't finna say the word because I ain't gonna get ghetto mark. You know, we ain't monetized yet. Make sure you subscribe. But yes, bro, like from the outside looking at that looks bad. If I if I wasn't a YouTuber, if I was just like a, a person, like like a concern or a more concerned, I guess, person <laughs> and seeing that I was like, oh my god, bro, like we, we gotta we bro, we gotta report this. We gotta call somebody. You feel me? Well, as a YouTuber, I already knew this this is content, bro. I know I see right through the book. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's the YouTuber in me or just the real in me. I, I don't know. But I see right through. I see like, bro, you're not. People do certain things, especially when you're a content creator. You do certain things for content. Even though you think or you might not even think that, hey, he, yeah, this might look bad. But he's, in his mind, he probably was saying, oh, I'm making this punishment video. This is going to show her and show the world, like, yeah, this kid needs to be punished. And all the parents are going to say, yeah, you did the right thing. No, <laughs> no, because on the eyes I look at it for the people who can't see past the, the content or the, the skit part, that looks bad, bro. Like, especially when you cutting a little girl's hair. My, like, it's bad. It's like, it's bad if, it, if it's a boy. It's horrible if it's a little girl. Like, what are you doing? So he could save his channel from a strike and still end up getting a strike. So, for those that keep telling me to tell him to post, he can't post because he has a strike from disciplining his yeah, child. But when he like don't discipline her or when we don't discipline her, it's like y'all bad parents. She grown, she ghetto, she this, she that. But then when we do it, oh, y'all could have kept that off camera. Blah, blah, blah. It's like y'all never said it fast. So I really can't Damn, never, ever give a fuck. Right. I it is what it is. It. Why are you trying to use your daughter to satisfy the internet? Or if they have all these opinions about her, bro, still do your discipline that you got to do off the camera. Off the camera. Why is you, what? I'm not going to prove no point about how, what? Come on, y'all too grown for that, bro. Catch on next one.